All right, everyone, welcome back to episode two of Dr. Stone. I am loving and I'm so interested so far in this series. It's such an interesting concept. Last episode, uh, we got introduced to the main characters, Taiju and Senku, and also Suzuria, who is still trapped in stone. Taiju and Senku have just made the elixir to break the stone curse, I guess I'll just call it, uh, off of like some birds. So we haven't tried it out on humans yet, so hopefully it works on that. Other than that, that's really it. I mean, we just got introduced to everything. There's still a lot more questions that need to be answered. Obviously, we're only on episode two, so we have a long ride ahead of us, my guys. I am super excited to see where this goes. So, hey, don't got too much to say. If you do enjoy this today's episode, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Also, if you do want to catch me live, I stream on Twitch over at twitch.tv slash IVXORY. Uh, it'll be here right on the screen, and it'll be in the description down below. Other than that... Don't got too much to say. Hope y'all are enjoying this so far. I mean, this and Fire Force are definitely my anime of the season so far, just by the first episode. And uh, Fire Force should go up with this as well. But, uh, other than that, guys, though, I hope you do enjoy, like I said. And uh, yeah, let's get into this. Yeah, my man Taiju was just about to confess his love. And then she got turned to stone. Everyone got turned to stone on the earth. Okay, see, so yeah, we broke the stone. Like, curse, I guess, off the birds. So, we haven't tried it out on actual humans yet, so hopefully it works on Caesarea. And what you guys told me is, like, there's no powers in this. It's just strictly scientific or realistic, I should say. So, I'm just gonna keep everything grounded. I'm not really gonna... There's no, like, fantasy aspects to it or anything. Oh, we get to free Caesarea finally. Let's go. My boy gets to confess his love finally. Bro, the visuals in this opening are phenomenal. My god, like the colors and everything. Also, Taiju looks a little different in the opening too. He looks like he looks like he changes a little bit. Wait, yo, my man is evil. He tried it on a fucking shard. Yo, these guys are such clowns too. I love how they interact with each other. Taiju, the first thing you better say as soon as she breaks out of that stone shell is you love her. Please do not make... Please do not hesitate, my guy. Bro! What are you doing? Oh! <laughs> Yo, she was gonna be naked. Oh my god, you, you, you straight plucked this man's eyes out. Bro, they straight up... <laughs> Yo, these boys are clowns. My man Taiju is a gentleman. He's like, nah, we can't leave Yuzuria out in the open exposed like that. We got to put some clothes on her. Then my man Senku was like, bro, why, come on. Nobody cares if, you know, her ass shows no matter what, bro. Please, like, let's just get this over with. Oh, shit, they got a lion? Bro, we better run. We, we better dip. We got to do the digital dash. Damn, the humans aren't on top of the food chain anymore. Bro, we're, we're on the run now. We're not doing the hunting anymore. We're the hunted. Damn, we got mad lucky to get latched onto those those vines. Shit. We're about to fight them off with spears? I mean, I guess we have a better chance than just our bare hands. But, bro, th these are lions, bro. Wild animals we're talking about here. Yo, there's no way we're about to use... I'm about to say, bro. I mean, like, you cannot be throwing her body around like that, bro. What if she breaks off or something? Yo, my man Taiju acting hella reckless right now. Exactly. Senku, tell him. We got to think logically in this situation. Yo, let's go. We stick together. No one's sacrificing nothing. We stick together, my guy. Let's go, my brother. Oh, okay. So he's not really a fighter. He's just he's just strong. He's more of a defensive type of person than a, a fighter. Okay. That's really interesting. Okay, so I'm still curious about this man. The strongest primate. Who the hell is this guy? Oh, they're about to... Oh, they're not about to use it on him. I mean, they're, they're not about to use it on Suzuria. They're about to use it on the other dude. Oh, shit, guys. Bro, hold up. Okay, it's not doing anything right now. Oh, shit. Okay, shit's about to go down. Who is this man? Is that cars? What's the situation? He already knows? Bro, this man doesn't look alarmed at all. He just like, yeah, you've been turned to stone for thousands of years. All right, cool. Bro, that's actually cars. What the fuck is this guy on? Bro, this dude built his fuck too. This man straight punching lions. Holy shit. Bro, man, my man got his dick hanging out and everything. He don't give a fuck. You telling me he, he petrified for thousands of years? 
he he breaks out, bro. Strong as fuck, punches a lion, bro. He's aware of everything already, bro. What? He's friendly though. I mean, bro, you're you're way too sexy to be friendly. Honestly, you look like you're about to betray us or something, dude. This dude is extremely strong. I don't know, too strong is a thing, but goddamn, I mean, for him to be able to punch a fucking lion, I mean, hell yeah, he's strong. Oh shit, yo Taiju, yo Taiju is getting scared that he's gonna take all of the women. Oh god, yo, yo Car is about to steal this man's girl. What? You went to Africa to research Ebola, my boy? I don't know about that, bro. They're they're talking all this good about him, telling me telling him he's like the super good guy so far. I don't know, man. Usually people like this turn out to be the antagonist. Holy shit, that was crazy. Okay. Okay, yeah, so we have to make more of that uh that that acid to melt off the uh the stone. Okay, I know his name is Sukasa, but keeping it real, I might just keep calling him Cars, bro. He he looks straight like Cars. I'm sorry. Oh, I thought that was Sukaya running for a second. I'm like, Jesus Christ. Bro, he is run. Okay, so you're telling me this man is faster than some running boars, can basically beat the shit out of any wild animal he sees. Alright, bro. Yeah, this dude is this dude's OP already. There's no way he's on our team. He's way too OP. And he's fucking sexy, bro. I mean, just look at all these qualities this guy has. There's no way he's on our team. Oh, Sukasa. I said Sukaya. There's no way, bro. I'm done. This man just broke a stone in half. And there's a waifu there. Bro, this man Sukasa. Yo. This man Sukasa is not human, guys. I don't understand. This dude is not human. He has to be some genetically modified person. <laughs> I love, I love, I love how Taiju acknowledges that I'm just, I'm dumb as fuck, bro. Leave all the science talk to you. He's like, I don't know any of this. Bro, these guys got me dead. Bro, these dudes got me dead. I love them so much. They really do a good job with like inserting comedy and like the interaction between the characters so far Bro, we need Senku in our party, bro. There's no way we would be living without Senku. This man knows way too much Jesus, this man has thought of everything Dr. Stone, hold up, that was a title drop. Okay, we got a title drop. Okay, Sukasa, you're kind of talking a little sus right now. Exactly, bro. Exactly. Some ul ulterior motives are right now. Nah, this dude, I do not trust him. This dude has some ulterior motives. Bro, Sanku, you better keep an eye on this man. Yo, my man Sukasa is straight looking like Jesus right now. Okay, we getting some backstory. Is that Sukasa getting his ass beat right now? Okay, my man is angry as fuck. And he just killed that guy. Okay. My man is going sicko mode right now. Okay, so my man Sukasa has some sort of hatred buried in his heart for some of these people. I knew it, bro. I knew it. I knew there was going to be some guy that's going to be like, hey, no, we got to keep this stone world. Okay, so yeah. Okay, Sukasa, you are the main You are the main villain. I agree then. Oh, my man Senku said nah, bro. He said nah. We ain't about that. Bro, let's go. Senku's such a badass. God damn. Damn, that was a good episode, though. Okay, a lot more. It ramped up definitely in the ending. Like, we finally got to see the main conflict, which is, okay, Sukasa wants to keep the stone world and just revive the youth and not have the adults back. I believe that's what he was trying to say. Or at least the bad people. But god damn. Ooh. This ending song, though. Woo! But yeah, guys, I really did enjoy today's episode. Oh my god. I mean, finally, at least I get to see the main conflict. Sukasa, there has to be something wrong with this man. This dude is not human. This man can beat the fuck out of lions and boars and run as fast as, like, these, these animals and can straight punch a rock and just destroy it. Nah, this dude has to be, like, some enhanced human being. 
He has to, uh, there has to be something wrong with him. But bro, Senku, he's such a badass. We he is needed in the party if we're going to survive. He knows so much and he thinks of he thinks everything through. So I'm excited to see to where like because obviously Sukasa completely overpowers them both. This man is insane. So I don't really know how we're gonna fight him. Maybe through the power of science, like I said, because I mean that's what kind of the anime is about, but hey. Really did enjoy today's episode. Hope you all did as well. Uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did. Also, guys, make sure to go check me out on twitch.tv slash IVXRY. That's where you catch all my live streams at. Make sure to go check that out. Follow your boy. Do everything. Hit your boy up. Come chat with me. Uh, and other than that, guys, um, really did enjoy today's episode. I keep saying that. But, hey, had a lot of fun. Uh, take care of yourselves. And I shall see you in the next video or in the next live stream. I'm actually about to go react to the, uh, Fire Force right now. So, if you're watching this, uh, I'll see you there. But other than that, take care, everybody.